Hi, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create advanced circle bursts. But before we start, um, I just want to thank you for helping me reach 500 subscribers. So, let's start. First, we're going to create a new composition and we're going to use 500 for um, the width and the height. Now we're going to click on the pen tool and we're going to draw a path like this and I'm holding down shift while I'm doing it. And now we're going to add trim paths to this shape layer. So we're just going to make two keyframes at the beginning. We're going to change the values to zero. Then we're going to press um, shift and page down to move 10 frames. And we're going to change both of these to 100. And now we're going to offset this one like that. And we're going to select all of these keyframes and we're going to press F9, which is going to easy ease them. So now uh, we made this and we're just going to press Control shift d to split this layer and we're going to delete um, the rest. And now we're going to click on the layer and we're going to press R which is going to bring up the rotation property. Um, I'm going to press um, Alt and I'm going to click on the stopwatch and now we're going to add an expression. So we're going to type in index um, multiplied by 360 and we're going to divide it by um, 12. And this is basically the same expression that we used um, in the um, previous circle burst tutorial. Um, so now I'm going to duplicate this layer five times so that I have um, six layers in total. And um, this is what we made up to this point. And now we're just going to offset these um, layers. So I'm going to click on shape layer one, and then I'm going to shift click on shape layer six, and I'm going to click on animation, keyframe assistant, um, sequence layers, and we're going to overlap them by eight frames. So let's click OK and this is what we've got. So now I'm going to create a new composition. It's going to be the same and I'm just going to um, give it a different name. I'm going to call it the creation. And now we're going to import this composition one. We're going to press R and we're going to Alt click on this stopwatch. And now we're going to type in the same expression um, multiplied by 360 and we're going to divide this by 2. So now if I make a copy of this layer you can see that we have a nice looking effect. So let's do the same thing but let's change this number to 3 and let's duplicate this two times and let's see what we've got. Okay, so that's looking pretty cool too. And let's undo that by pressing Control Z. And let's do um, four. So let's duplicate this one four times. And as you can see, we are getting some pretty cool um, effects. So now let's create a new composition using the HDTV 1080 preset. I'm just going to call this main and let's import the decoration composition and as you can see it's looking pretty nice. So let's just press S and change the scale to 150. Okay. And now let's duplicate this layer and let's offset this one by one frame. And then um, we're going to click on the effects and presets tab and you're just going to type in tint and we're going to apply that effect to this um, composition. And we're going to uh, map white to maybe red. OK. 
Okay, uh, let's take a look at what we've got. So as you can see, this looks pretty cool. And we made it in like five minutes. So this is basically just to give you an idea of what you can do. So let's change this um, to three. Let's, and let's duplicate this two times. Let's take a look at this now. I like this one a bit more. So that's it. As you can see, you can create some really interesting elements um, really quickly um, with circle bursts. If you would like to request a tutorial, then please um, click on the link in the description. Um, if you would like to see more tutorials, then check out my channel and subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you next time.